On August 7th of 2021, the 20-year-old Jakob Ingebrigtsen from Norway won the men's Olympic gold medal in the 1500, breaking the Olympic record by just over three seconds. This was a flawlessly executed race, as he ran each 400 meter split slightly faster than the previous one, and for his final 100 meters, he unleashed probably the fastest finish of his career, finally outperforming his longtime rival, Timothy Chariot from Kenya. For the previous four years, Jakob had not been able to take down Chariot even once, typically falling less than two seconds behind during his races. However, after 10 consecutive losses, dating all the way back to June 18th of 2017, he finally turned his middle distance luck around, and he did it on the biggest stage in the world. For the past few seasons, the name Ingebrigtsen has been synonymous with international success, and specifically for Jakob, his status as a middle distance prodigy has been the source of endless hype and excitement. And even through profound skepticism on his talents, he managed to deliver against the most talented field in the world. The fact that this young Norwegian won the Olympic gold medal is still difficult to believe at times, but it actually did happen. And while this single achievement will forever be one of Jakob's greatest career accomplishments, he also completed something else this season that unquestionably makes him one of the greatest running talents in history. It's August 16th of 1997. On a seemingly normal evening in Monaco, one athlete from Kenya would make history. In the men's 1500 meters, Daniel Komen from Kenya placed first with a time of 3 minutes 29.46 seconds, taking down an extraordinarily talented field. This performance marked the very first time that Komen had ever broken 3 minutes and 30 seconds for the 1500, and after this race, it made Komen the first athlete ever to have run under 3.30 for the 15, under 7.30 for the 3,000, and also under 12 minutes and 50 seconds for the 5,000 meters. This magnificent combination of strength and speed was so rare that for the next 24 years, no other athlete was ever able to match this achievement. Well, that is until 2021, when Jakob Ingebrigtsen became the only other athlete to match Daniel Komen. Heading into this season, his personal bests had already made him one of the fastest distance running talents in history. However, his 5,000 meters was clearly not at its full potential. After years of lowering his personal best, Ingebrigtsen finally entered another 5,000 meter race, except this time, he was set to clash against none other than the world record holder himself, Joshua Cheptegei. For this 5K showdown in Florence, Italy, Ingebrigtsen ran one of the most impressive races of his career, not necessarily because of his overall time, but because of the way he paced this race. Through the opening two kilometers, he was still holding on quite close to the front athletes, who hit a split of 5 minutes and 11 seconds. However, after the 2K split, Joshua Cheptegei increased the pace dramatically, and Ingebrigtsen actually lost contact with the front runners. This appeared to be a moment of true struggle for Jakob, as the four athletes up front were now separating from everyone else. But just one lap later, the 20-year-old Norwegian had incredibly closed the gap on the front pack, and he once again appeared to be one of the favorites to win this race. Over the final 800 meters, Cheptegei actually fell back from the front pack, and then over the final lap and over the final 100 meters, Ingebrigtsen sprinted away to a stunning victory in a new 5,000 meter PB of 12 minutes 48.45 seconds, now becoming only the second athlete ever to run under 3.30, under 7.30, and under 12.50 for the 5K. Just like Daniel Komen, this special blend of speed and strength is so uncommon that when it does happen, an athlete is almost guaranteed a global medal. Back in 1997, just six days after running his 329, Komen returned to the track to break the 5,000 meter world record, achieving an amazing time of 12 minutes and 39 seconds. These two times also came in the same season where Komen placed first in the world championships, winning the 5,000 meters with a time of 13 minutes 7.38 seconds. And of course, in the previous season, Komen set one of the greatest distance running world records ever with his stunning 3,000 meter record of 7 minutes 20.67 seconds, a time that genuinely makes me question my own reality. 
After breaking four world records within a one-year period, Komen's international stardom unfortunately started to fade, as his overall performances started to decrease from his previous few seasons. For many, Komen's exploits to this day are still some of the most shocking and influential moments in distance running history. But for one reason or another, his career was abnormally short. This brings us back to Jakob Ingebrigtsen. In comparison to Komen, his personal bests are still quite far from what Komen achieved, at least in the 3K and the 5K. But given his gold medal performance in the 1500 meters this season, he clearly has a shot at becoming one of the all-time greats in running history. To say that Ingebrigtsen is just another talented European athlete is a big understatement. In almost every single event that he enters, his performances are almost always world class, even in racing distances he normally doesn't jump into. And while he may or may not be a second coming of Daniel Komen, he has certainly already cemented his name as one of the most talented middle distance athletes ever, and he is still only 21 years of age. As of 2021, he currently holds eight national records, four European records, and after his stunning 1500 in Tokyo, he now holds one incredible Olympic record. At this point in his career, the future seems almost limitless. From the 1500 up to the 5000, even potentially up to the half marathon, it seems as though this young talent can pretty much do anything, and who knows, perhaps one day he'll even jump up to the marathon and throw down a super quick time. But for now, Ingebrigtsen has stated that after this Olympic victory, his new goal will be shooting for world records, which will certainly be an incredible challenge, but if anyone can do it, Ingebrigtsen is certainly one of the key athletes to make these attempts. And now I want to hear from all of you, do you think Jakob Ingebrigtsen has a shot at any distance running world records? And if so, what times do you think he can take down? Leave your thoughts in the comment section down below. Thanks for watching everyone. And as always, Jakob Ingebrigtsen is an absolute legend.